I'm a professor at Utah State University in Logan, Utah. I consider myself a Republican because I share the values that the Republican Party tries to promote. Um, I am concerned about the national debt. I, I consider myself a fiscal conservative, and I believe that the Republicans, more than the Democrats, are are you know follow that agenda that they try to be the conservative party. I've identified Republican my entire life. I uh, until just recently when uh, President Trump ran for office, I just couldn't bring myself to vote re vote for him at that uh, at the last election. And so I actually. Uh, wrote in somebody, which was Mitt Romney, as someone who I, you know, I knew he wasn't going to win, but I could not, in good conscience, vote for either candidate. I thought in 2016 we had the worst possible candidates possible. You know, when he was um, voted in as president, I decided to give him a shot and hope that he would rise to the occasion. Uh, he has not done that. Uh, he seemed to be someone who was more concerned about advancing his own agenda, uh, enriching himself, as opposed to a genuine concern about the country. I, I would describe him as probably the most corrupt president, uh, U.S. president in my lifetime, certainly. The stock market is going up, 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 but at the same time, we're running national deficits and uh, putting in jeopardy the long-term health of our national economy. Um, <clears throat> in 2020, I'm also not thrilled about Joe Biden, but I consider him to be a much better qualified president than our current president, President Trump. Uh, I think he will bring back, uh, well, he'll be less dis divisive, which I think President Trump is very divisive. He'll be bring back decorum to the presidency um, and just some common sense than what we have right now with President Trump. So yeah, I'm willing to vote for Joe Biden.